Right, hello. So this is um, Dynatron mission on the Spectrum 48K. Yeah, as you can see, I'm running it from an emulator. Um, I do have the game, obviously. Yes, I do. Um, it's around my parents' house. Um, but I don't have the Spectrum with me right now because it's around my parents' house. Um, it's, I think I've got the game. Definitely got the game. I know my dad hasn't thrown the cassettes away. My mum might have. I'm not sure. Um, let's just assume that I do have the game. Anyway, I played it to death so many times, but this was like over 20 years, 25 years ago, something like that. Well, it would be now. Um, so yeah, so this is a game where you're a space kind of person, man. Not an alien, it's a human dude. Um, you get dropped down onto a planet where a bomb has been kind of uh, set and your job your mission is to go and um, defuse the bomb and that's it there's no shooting in the game there's no fighting <coughs> sorry I've got a bad cough so there's no fighting in the game um, there are enemies but they're just kind of floating vehicle. not that you see there that's actually something that you grab onto and it pulls you across places um, but <clears throat> there are enemies to avoid the thing about this game is um, you get three lives you touch just the slightest touch kills you instantly of anything that's bad but fortunately <coughs> you don't start right from the beginning of the game you start from the screen that you're on. You restart in the same screen. Okay, um, and the only thing you can do is run and jump and duck. And that's it. So let's start the game. Level zero, Nova base. Prepare to penetrate. Yes, okay, right. A disappearing hang glider in space. Um, obviously, hang gliders don't work in space, but this one does. That noise that you can hear is your heart monitor. I don't really know why the heart monitor's there. I've never kind of got that far into the game. Yes, I played it a lot, but I'm over. I'm rubbish sure this game's difficult, and from what I've read, this game's difficult. But I'm also rubbish, so kind of a good combination there. Uh, but yes, that's a heart rate monitor, and I'm assuming once you diff diffuse the bomb or you're getting near the bomb, the heart rate starts going up. So anyway, look, here we are. He's doing a little dance for you. Um, little running thing. There, he's running, jumping, and that's all the moves that he does. He does a low jump. When you hold down the fire button, he runs, but he also does a higher jump. And that's it. So off we go. Wish me luck. Me. Good luck. Thank you. I knew I needed that. So you zip through that. <coughs> that's nothing. Those clouds hurt you, by the way. And if you died on that, I mean, there's pl plenty of times where I've actually forgotten how to play the game. Yeah, you don't want to get hit by lasers. This way. I can tell you now there's a dead end so I'm not going to go down that way you'll have to take my word for it or play the game yourself yeah super right these things obviously hurt you they don't crush you you just touch them and you die so you know yeah they're just kind of death blocks Here's a death block, and I'm using an anti-gravity machine device. And this, there's a laser here, so I knew that. You get moving platforms that make you do a Michael Jackson non-moonwalk robotic dance thing. And let's go. There's more uh, poisonous clouds. 
and these are the things that look like something from Spaceman Frogger you just avoid them one touch and you're dead this thing picks you up Ah, oh, there you go. That's it. I forgot to hold down the fire button. Right, that laser is a laser floor. And the idea is to get across without getting hit. By that, which I did. Yay! And another laser floor. and another laser floor. Now, exit screen. Bomb must be detonated before escape possible. Yes, so you've got to detonate the bomb. Oh, you've got to detonate the bomb. So it's not defuse the bomb, you have to detonate the bomb. Okay, so I don't like this planet and all its inhabitants, I'm gonna blow it up. And that's why you've got the heart rate monitor. You detonate the bomb, you've got a certain amount of time to get back here. which is, uh, you know, good, I guess. Ooh. Ah. Ah. Ah, dear me. Ah, scary. Right. <sighs> ah! <laughs> silly, 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 silly. Whoa! Ah! You know what? It literally has been. I reckon I probably played Dinatron Mission in probably about. Uh, 1993 or the latest maybe 93, 94 so it's been over 20 years since I've seen this screen and probably the last couple of screens to be honest with you so this is real kind of <coughs> this is real nostalgia time for me Whoa. Rah. Wow. Rah. It's a nice game. Why, I did it. No, I did it, I did it, I did it. I don't want to go back. Well, why did I do that? I didn't need to do that. Whoa, yeah, yeah, yeah. Scott, you're so cool at this game. What's going on? Well, you're not really. You've lost a lot of your lives, but um, you know what I mean. Better than I'm doing better than I ever did. I probably did get here. Now, how do you? Ah, that's it. Rah. Hey. Right. I don't ever remember getting up there. Ah! <laughs> Stop it. Ah! Hold the fire button down. Thank you. Right. Now, no messing around. Gotcha. Whoa, I remember these. Ah! 
Oh ja, ja. Oh, there's a scratch in my nose here. Danger, danger. Can I stand? <coughs> no, I'm going to die. Oh, no, I'm not. Ah. I do reckon I have been here. So usually I die within like the first five or six screens because I'm that bad. But how I'm going to get across that, I don't know. No, I really don't know. Ah! Yeah! Yes, as you can see, um, that's it. And then obviously, you know, there's no save games in this thing. You can't carry on where you left off. Oh no. No, you don't. If you want to start again, that's what you do. Start again. But I'm not one of those people who's going to start again because, you know what? I don't care. No, I don't care. Anyway, that was it. That was uh, a Dynatron mission published by Mastertronic in 1987 uh, for the ZX Spectrum. It's a nice looking game. I do like it. But, yeah, I mean, these screens, I've never seen them before. I've never been there. That one I've been to just now. Yeah, I don't get that one. I I'm, presume I'm sure you should just slide down there. Anyway, um, yeah, that was it. Have a nice time, whatever you do. See ya. <laughs>